Welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We are jumping in once again on a little bit of a streak, and um, it's it's actually it's. I, I, do you know? I started a sentence. I had a thing that I wanted to say in mind, and I have just completely forgotten what I wanted to say. I was like, it's. I was gonna say it's like a good day or something, but then I was like, I mean, it is, but that's not what I was gonna say. What the hell was I gonna say? Uh, let's play it as Tainted Maman again. I like him. He do be a fun boy. Um, we'll see what we've got left to do as him. Um, but yeah. Anyways. <laughs> I've just completely forgot. What the hell was I going to say? Oh my god, my brain. To be fair, it is the morning. Like, I won't say early, it's like 10am. Um, but I have brain rot because of that, apparently. I just can't think. But anyways, we are jumping in for another episode. I'm gonna try and do a good few episodes today. I have, I have been a, a very, a very lazy boy. Um, is this is poverty the one where our coins disappear? I'm not sure. Um, I can't remember. Um, I'm talking about the curse, by the way. But yeah, um, we can have a good old time as this little piggy here. We've got to do. Let's do light path if we can, or maybe beast. Oh really? I didn't, I didn't know you fired fire as well. Uh, we could do light path mega sit and all like beast. We'll see. We'll see how good our run ends up being. I guess. Um, we'll see how good our run ends up being. We won't go to the item room yet because we want to get our curses later on rather than early. We'll see how many curses we end up getting. Unfortunately, no room drop. Uh, sorry, enemy drop curses as of yet. Dude, these these fucking things they fire out at such high velocity. Stay away from me, shit. We're good. We're good. We're good. Oh. That is a that is a way to start a run if I've ever seen one. That's lovely. Okay, we got him. But yeah, I really like this character. He's a lot of fun. I like the curses and stuff. It's 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 a pretty interesting little dude. But yeah, morning episode. It's it, it's kind of an interesting thing. I've said it before how like recording in the morning is just like a good way to like get your brain working. But then again, at the minute my brain isn't working very well because I feel like I've started saying about six sentences and forgotten about it instantly. Um. Outside of treasure rooms, cares trinkets are replaced with a single penny. In treasure rooms, are replaced with... Okay, that's terrible. Definitely not taking that. Um, I don't know why anyone would take that, especially... Oh, dude, this is bad. It's okay, we're good, we're good. Just keep our distance, keep our distance. Um, but yeah, I, I've, I've been hopping between topics, I have no idea. I, I'm honestly, I'm really tired right now. Uh, so I'm hoping this just... I've, I've started recording so that I can hopefully wake myself up a little bit. Um... We'll see if that works. <laughs> but yeah, at the minute, I've been doing a really, really poor job of, um, of like, keeping my recordings going. Honestly, D uh, Diablo 4 and Battlebit came out, and I've just, like, completely disregarded my, um, my YouTube channel. <laughs> uh, I've been getting the videos recorded that I need to and pretty much nothing more. So it means that I haven't really had um, a backlog or anything. Um, I, I will take that. It's, it's pretty horrible, but I'll take it. Yeah, okay. Let's let's go do the boss, and then we'll come back and uh, sell everything. <laughs> let's go, go, go. Um, yeah, like, basically, I've been making sure to record Isaac each day, but I've not had a backlog going, which is pretty terrible. Um, and then, uh, I, I, like, Dead Estate kind of fell by the wayside because I didn't really have time for it because I was playing too much other games. And, uh, Gungeon at the minute has fallen by the wayside. Do not worry, Gungeon will be back, but at the minute it is not. But it will be back, uh, hopefully tomorrow. Um, and yeah, like, I've got no backlog of, um, oh, bloody hell. I've got no backlog of Isaac right now. I'm literally just recording, like, day to day as I need the episodes. Really not a good way to do it. I, I at one point, I at one point in my life, when Repentance first came out, had 70, I am not kidding, 70 episodes backlogged. I was recording something like three to four every day, and obviously only uploading one a day. And I did that for a good couple of months. So I had 70 videos backlogged. Now I have none. <laughs> I always like to have a backlog of at least three videos, because basically if I get really ill, or if I have to do something unexpected, um... It gives me the opportunity, uh, but at the minute I don't have that, so yeah, I definitely need to get back on it, and today I'm going to partially do that, I'm going to try and fit in at least three Isaac episodes and get like a bit of a backlog going. Right, item room, what do you behold for us? I mean, it doesn't really matter what you behold for us, because we're going to be uh, selling it down the river anyways. 
Give me all the money. Thank you. Um, Unicorn Stump. Mm, unicorn Stumps. Do you know what? I haven't done a run with Unicorn Stump in a really long time. It's not it's not that good right now, but it has potential, so I'm going to give it a go. Like, it just... If we get an orbital of any kind, it becomes pretty good. Also, get into cash rooms, stuff like that. And there you go. Freebie. We got a penny. Yay. Right, anyways, let's go. As for the question of the day to day, hmm... Hmm. Hmm. What's something people would like to see from this channel? In general, just overall, even if it's something that, that you might think is unrealistic for me to do, it'd be interesting to hear what, what sort of people's uh, hopes would be for the channel and hopes would be for the content. I'd be I'd be really intrigued to know. Um, unfortunately, terrible. Um, yeah, I'd be really intrigued to know what people's potential hopes for the channel is. Okay, I'm... Taking some bad damage here. Let's uh, let's be careful, shall we? Try and take you out before you summon another beast. You've done it. You've done it now. Good. Again, leave the item room to last. There's no need. But yeah, I'm really hoping I can get myself a... Um, try and take you out first. Really hoping I can get myself some sort of orbital. I mean, the easiest one to get would be like a cube of meat. Because um, we could just fight a boss to get one of those. But yeah, it's always interesting to hear what you guys would like to see from the channel, whether it's something that's sort of on brand for me or not. I I have considered toying with the idea. Um, ooh, I, if I remember correctly, this is absolutely horrible. I'm gonna take it anyway. I'm gonna I'm gonna be a risky bisky. Um, but yeah, um, one I, I've considered toying with the idea of changing sort of how I generally upload content. Because at the minute, obviously, the way that I upload content is I do Isaac Daily and then other series on specific days. Or like, at the minute, not so specific days, just kind of when I can. Um, but I was like, maybe I should like try changing how I do series where I like do Isaac and one of the series that I focus on really hard. Um, so like, I do like my Isaac series and then like once every other day I do like Voidigo and then I go back to Gungeon for a little bit and then I go back to another game and I do like sort of series of a game that are like you get more episodes per week but the series like don't obviously last as long um I don't know it's 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 just a thought I've had I don't know if I should change things up really I mean people kind of like the way that I do things now I think um take that yeah, I'm going to say, it's like, I, people kind of probably like the way I do things now, so I don't really want to change things up too much. But at the same time, it's like, there's, there's different ways I could do things. Cares of Darkness, I'll take that for five coins, why not? I don't know what happened over there, but some shenanigans went down. I'm pretty sure this is the one that sells all my coins, yeah. Although, um, it sells for ten. It's actually worth it. Damn it, I was hoping I could get one of those guys hit. But we lost all of our money, but that was worth 10. So as long as we had less than 10, it was going to yield more rewards than it cost us. Yeah. Oh, This guy having faster projectile speed is an absolute nightmare. So we're probably going to lose some HP to this guy. Yeah, good. Right, keep it going. And like, as well, I need to sort of, I need to really evaluate and think of when I'm going to stop doing Isaac daily. Like, it's not something that I sort of want to do, but I think realistically at some point I'm going to have to stop doing it daily. And I don't, like I said, I don't really want to, but at the same time it is, like, Isaac obviously is an, an older game now. And on top of that, like, the views are still decent, but they have definitely diminished over time. And it would just give me more opportunity to play newer things. And I think that people would like that. And also, it just gives gives the ability for the channel to sort of grow to a new audience. I think right now, um, as you can probably see by my subs, it, they've kind of stagnated a little bit. Because obviously, uh, I've kind of found my audience. I've found the people that watch Isaac. And that's kind of not growing anytime soon, really. Um... So we'll just kind of have to see with that. Oh, one minute. I've got a really itchy eye. 
Oh, god damn. I swear, whenever I'm recording, my body just betrays me with, like, being itchy and stuff. Um. So, yeah, it's kind of like I'm not really sure what's best. Trying to use the, uh, the Wisp here while we have invincibility. Because the Wisp is also invincible while we have invincibility. Um. Yeah, I, I'm gonna say, it's not something that I've got sort of on the short term. Um. Check in here, I guess. Wrath is always fun. I'm going to take it. Wrath is beautiful. Right. Let's keep it going. Go back and do our shop. We, we don't have enough keys for the item room right now, but the shop is, is way more valuable, so I don't really mind. Go straight for the shop. Yeah, it's, it's just something that I'm going to have to eventually evaluate, so I need to think about it. Good amount of money there. We'll take that. Take that. Um, don't think there's anything else I want there. Unfortunately, a lot of actives coming our way, which, yeah, not particularly pleased about. <laughs> Let's keep it moving and grooving. We got good money for the next floor, which means we don't have to rely on curses to buy stuff, which is rather nice. We can go to the shop early. Right, let's get gone to the next floor. Oh yeah, it's like, I love the fact that people love Isaac on my channel, and I love the fact that I've got this... Like, I, I just like playing Isaac daily as, like, not even really for the game, it's just, like, a nice routine now. Um, but especially in, like, situations like I'm in now where, like, there's new games out and I really want to play, like, loads of these new games. It's like, it, it, it is a little bit, like, taxing to sort of have to take a break from the games I'm really enjoying to go and play Isaac that I've played a billion times before. And it's not like I don't enjoy the runs, like, it's not like I don't enjoy the the content i'm playing at all that's definitely not it but it is still like one of those things um i'll open these for potential keys oh, we got a baleful heart awesome let's hope we can keep that around baleful hearts are pretty darn useful so happy to have that dude what why am i getting this cast trinket all the time go away no one no one wants that Good. Really, Ghost? You had to take that long to scoot around him and do your business? I had six broken hearts. Okay. Broken heart-wise, we are not looking good right now, but hey her. I think we actually lost some health by taking that. Okay, Wrath. Pretty darn cool. Oh my god, why did I get hit there? Please don't lose the Baleful Heart, it's actually pretty darn useful. There's our key. Okay, we'll just go to the shop as soon as we find it. Good, good. It's kind of funny because we have this ghost that's doing a very similar movement to the, uh, the Wrath shots now. It looks kind of cool. Hey, there's another key as well. I need to remember I've got invincibility if I get overwhelmed as well. Um, boosts the power and sell value of all other cast trinkets. I'll, I'll take that for now. Luckily, it didn't give me more broken hearts. Otherwise, that would have been tragic. I didn't even think about that. That would have been really bad. Good. Uh, hell no, I'm taking that. Hell no. Uh, we can go in here. Cast the unknown. Not ideal. I'll take it anyways. Thing is as well, Cares the Unknown. It seems bad, but you just sell it and it's fine. Like, you're like, oh no, I'm going to have to buy shop items blind. It's like, no, you don't. You just sell it and it's fine. Yeah, these guys are a bit annoying. Oh, Cares the Unknown's health anyways. I'm a dumbass. Right, what we got here? Familiar that steals pickups and chance to remove a uh, coin and spawn spinny pennies when enemy dies. Spinny pennies expire. I'll just take that one for now. Enter a room from a random door. Go for that as well. I like the fact that all the little spiders still create the wrath shots. 
I mean, it's literally the same one again. Oh, you bastard. He managed to get that key before I did. Oh, dude. Don't like you guys. Oh, God. This is, this is so goddamn confusing. I didn't think about how confusing this would be. Okay. I like the fact that it actually randomizes what the doors look like as well. That's pretty cool. So this is secret room, right? Ha! Huh, that's pretty cool. So was the other secret room here? Yeah, it was. Okay, that's that's pretty cool that we get to like see where the secret rooms are. This curse has some value to it. Okay, I've got to make sure to be quick in picking stuff up. Otherwise... Oh, dude, the guy steals chests as well. What the fuck? I didn't expect him to steal chests. Okay. I need to find the shop pretty quickly here. Things are getting confusing. Things are getting very confusing. I've got to be sort of take a second to assess where I am as soon as I enter a room because I'm going to enter from the wrong door. Okay, just use invincibility to get through this room. Um, cast the blind, just take it, go in here, sell everything. This is going to be a ton of money here. Awesome. Take that. Take that. I mean, why not take that as well? Take that. I guess I could at least blow you up. Hey, baby stats. Nice. Okay. We are good to go. That was confusing, but we got through it in the end. Um, again, I'm just going to do this because I can't be arse dealing with that room. Invincibility makes things easier for me. Do we have a good way of generating um, spiders? I don't know where we got these ones from. I think we got them from a sack, didn't we? So we're not really going to have a great way of generating them. It's fine. So unless this curse is like really a non-detrimental one, we do not have to take it. Um, why isn't Wrath working? Excuse me, Wrath? Why aren't you working anymore? Please don't tell me, Wrath. Wait. Oh, you bastard. Okay, I know why Wrath isn't working anymore. That's annoying. So, um, Wrath scales off of broken hearts. Um, and if you don't have any broken hearts, it doesn't work. And removing that trinket removed all of my broken hearts. Which is good for my health, but now Wrath doesn't work. That is, uh, that is not how that's meant to work. That's annoying. So I don't really have a way of generating broken hearts now, apart from getting that, uh, that cursed trinket. So that's, that's kind of annoying. Oh, goddamn. That's a bit of an oopsie. Um, Cursed the Lost. Hell no, I'm taking Cursed the Lost. Do not think so. Also, our boss items have been dookie so far. Alright, just get me to the shop as quick as possible here. Cursed of Jamming. I'm going to guess that's something to do with jamming my donation machine. It's fine by me, really. So yeah, we just, we kind of got a bit of a DPS down here, like a 30% damage downgrade. Which is a bit sad, but unfortunately just is what it is. Drop a key, you fat shit. Not that I need it, but I want it. My little pooter girl is doing a, doing a good job right now. She's getting up in there. I like it. Keep doing it, pooter queen. I like you with your little boem. Holy shit, they moved at some speed there. Honestly, she's pretty good. I didn't realize how like fast and speedy she was. Imagine getting her with BFF. That'd be really fun. Nice. Like she just gets up in there and fires and stuff. It's like she doesn't do a ton of damage or anything, but she's really helping out. Yeah, I really want BFF with her now and see see how she works. I mean, double damage on that would be would be kind of lovely. All right, come on, please say we're going the right way to the shop. Oh, it's Pooter v Pooter, husband versus wife in the ultimate battle. Go, go, go. Ha ha. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Oh, fuck. Oh, that was like guaranteed damage there. Ooh, saved myself with some invin invincibility there. Still don't have an orbital, sadly. Hoping this shop can provide. We shall see. Extra bombs. Right, so we have Candy Heart, which is not amazing. Um. 
These really are items are not very good here. Like, not very good at all. Our shops have been really kind of trash. It's gonna give me Spy Desire. I'm gonna play you down to, like, one more player. You are the worst beggar to ever exist. Whoever designed you should be trialed as a criminal. Because they, they are just horrendously gross. So yeah, this is a bit of a rough run, to be honest. Because we just... We're missing out on so many potential items. Because basically every single shop has had, like, three actives in it. And, like, the passives have been kind of trash. And we've only got, like, two shops left. So... Not... Not birding particularly well, I'll be honest. Like, this might even be a run that I could just restart, because, yeah. Honestly, we've got no damage bonus so far. We've only got a slight bonus to our fire rate. We've got an active that's virtually useless most of the time. Oh, come on. Okay, good, we got him. It's virtually useless most of the time. It's just like, eh, this is rough. Oh, also... Can I just say, um, let's just check what we've got going on in here. Empty vessel, I will take. And I'll definitely take that now as well. Um, okay. Can I just say, oh wait, I'm so stupid. I took empty vessel and immediately cancelled it. I am a big idiot. Um, so Edmund put up a tweet recently saying that he's going to do another... Like, what are the 10 worst items I'm going to buff them? Same with, I think, trinkets and pickups as well, he said. Uh, like, cards and stuff. Uh, which is pretty nice to see that there's another update coming out. Although, I think, um... I think Vin won't be working on it, uh, Kilburn. Because I'm pretty sure he said that he's done with Isaac now. So, unless he's just taking a prolonged break and getting back to it, it might be done by Nicholas. Which, honestly, if it is, I'd rather not have an update at all. Because Nicholas can't be trusted with fucking opening a bag of, uh, crisps. Never mind making an update. Goddamn, they are... Some of the worst developers I've ever known. Uh, but anyways, the, we'll, we'll see how that turns out. Um, and, uh, yeah, like, I was reading through the comments of what I... The fuck? The fuck was that? Oh, this is part of the curse. Um, I was reading through the comments of what items people wanted buffing. And, oh my god, people in the Isaac community are fucking dullards. Holy shit. Someone was like, Crown of Light needs buffing because it's only active until you get hit. Are you deranged? Are you actually deranged? Crown of Light needs a buff. It gives you double damage. Double damage. Oh yeah, it might not be active for your entire hush fight. It might not be active for your entire boss fight. But for most rooms, it's going to be active the entire time. Even as a bad player, for most rooms, it's going to be active the entire time. What are you talking about, you pleb? Um, and then, yeah, pe someone said that Hive Mind needs a buff. Hive Mind needs a buff because it's only because it's incredibly niche when it works. It doesn't it doesn't work if you don't have any way to generate flies or spiders. And it gives all of your flies and spiders double damage. And there is literally so many ways in this game to generate flies and spiders. Come on now. They were like, oh, it should add a chance to generate some flies or spiders. Someone was like, oh, um, Curse of the Tower needs to give you a stat up. N no, it fucking doesn't. Like, oh my god. Someone was like, oh, Bob's brain needs a... No, Bob's brain doesn't fucking need a buff. God damn it. Bob's brain is not a bad item. It's a risky item, for sure. It's got a hell of a lot of risk. You're gonna hit yourself with it. But it does so much fucking damage. It can one-shot certain bosses. Like, come on now, people. Be reasonable. <laughs> Don't be so fucking stupid. <laughs> oh my god, there's just, there's just so many people calling for items to be buffed that just have absolutely no business being touched. Like, some really good items. Um... Someone said that red key needs buffing because four room charge is too much. Are you... Are you okay? Are you alright? Like, come on now. It doesn't need buffing. You want it to be buffed. Do that with mods. That doesn't... That's not a need at all. Ancient recall. It's just... Oh my god. We've got a golden pill.
Really? I got to use it twice? Okay, thanks. But yeah, I just, I just, I just can't believe some of the things that people were suggesting. Like items that do need a buff are stuff like Hushy and the Delirious Active. Those are sort of things that need buffing because they're trash. All right, please give me some better stuff on the next floor. It's just like, oh my god, I just can't. Like, people are like, oh yeah, someone was like, Tiny Planet needs a buff. No. No, it for you don't like Tiny Planet. There's a difference. Tiny Planet is a pretty good item, and it has some really interesting synergies and stuff. You don't like it. That that is it. You don't like it. That that does not mean. Sorry, sorry that I'm getting so heated here, but it's just like goddamn people. Just because you don't like an item doesn't mean it needs a buff. So many people as well. So many people are like boomerang tears. What what what's that item called? My reflection. My reflection needs a buff. No, it fucking doesn't. Literally, my reflection is not bad at all. It's actually a pretty good item. Like, it gives you a massive range buff to the point of, like, you being able to pretty much, um... Oh, God, I do not like this. Uh, I'm excited going on here. This guy's generating way too much shit. What the fuck's going on here? Ca Dude. What, what the fuck is this? Calm down. There you go. Um... Yeah, it's like... It gives you a massive range buff to the point of where your tier is going to be, like, traveling... Ooh, I'll take this guy. It's going to be traveling the distance it would have been traveling anyways. And then if you miss, it comes back. And it has cool synergies. It's like, people. People. Please. Ow. It's just funny. It's just funny to me that, like, oh my god. Oh god, this run is, is, is feeling rather trash. Wheel of Fortune. This guy again? Devil card. I will take it. Right, this shop better be amazing. I need a damage up real bad. Oh my god, stop being feared, I can't hit you. We really need an orbital, because now we have two forms of potential invincibility. Oh my god, look how long it's taken to kill this guy. Holy shit. Being at this floor with no damage ups is rough. It's also the fact as well on this run, our boss items have been really bad too. Oh, dude, I can't even kill these clickety-clacks in time. There you go. Low shot speed, I don't care. Got really itchy nerves for some reason. That's just some ghosties. I can handle ghosts. Come on, shop. Please provide. This guy's going to be a nightmare. Use the wisp. Use the wisp. Uh, chance to remove coin and uh, you're afflicted with bleed. Actually, not a bad thing. I'll take bleed. While I have a wisp, it's actually pretty okay. Where did I get my other wisp from? Oh god, it's gone now. I had two for a second there, I don't know where it came from. Oh, does, does my little ghosty boy give me wisps sometimes? That, if so, that's actually really good. Dude, these these two trink these, these two care trinkets show up way too fucking often. Go away. Oh god. Shop, where art thou? Is 
Good, good. Again? These aren't great. If this gives me three damage ups, then I'll be happy. No damage ups. That's close to what I wanted. We've got the spider baby going on. Transformation. Lost contact here. We've got one more shop going on, so I'll save some stuff there for that. Right. Oh my god. I've, got, I've become very heated now about talking about this. People don't know what they're talking about. So it's, it's frustrating. People are goobers. Oh, but bloody hell, I trapped myself in there. I'm just so annoyed that we don't have Wrath helping us out anymore. <laughs> Wrath got stolen from me. The single wisp isn't really doing enough either here. Are you spawning black burnies is not not great. Oh god, you telefragging me is also not great. I can't kill this burnies without a fast enough fire rate, god damn it. Hey, Bernie friend, help me out. This is this has been a real struggle bus, this has. A real struggle bus. Guess I've a deceiver heart there, which dis what what the fuck? It disappeared. <laughs> been there already. Don't think that's worth it. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, all of our boss items have been complete garbage, and most of our shop items have been complete garbage. So, we have, like, an interesting semblance of items here, but nothing really good. The, I think go, the, um, the Grim Reaper guy is good. Lost Contact is potentially good, but not right now. Wisp. What does this King of Diamonds do again? Inflicts all enemies in the room with Midas freezing. Okay, nice. Can't take a damage down, I'm sorry. Eh, not very good. Right. You've just kind of got to hope for the best here. Get out of here, Ghosty. Oh my god. I'm half a hit off of death. Can't be doing this. This is tragic. We got a good few of them killed there. Not an awful lot, but a good few. Golden key in here as well. Right, shop, I need you to provide for me right now. I need you to provide so much for me. Okay. I will say that has provided a good bit for me here. Um, I very much like that. I think I'll take this as... I don't know, how, how will this work? I don't remember. It doesn't. Great. What a great way to spend my money. Now I've just got to somehow live. Tech X is a good start. Especially with um, Shielded Tears. The shop... Had provided. I'm very annoyed that uh, it does work. It just it just doesn't work the way it should. Okay. 
good. We need damage still. Uh, item rooms that have items. We don't need any shit from there anymore. I'm going to my item room like, ooh, I wonder what we'll get. Absolutely nothing. Huzzah. Right, this guy can drop us burn hearts, so that's kind of what I'm betting on right now. Just gotta do the mother fight without getting hit is all. Is it red mother? It is, which is, eh, I don't know if that's better. It's, it's kind of harder to deal damage to her, but it's a little bit safer in, on average. So there's less enemies that she's spawning. Okay, we got invincibility now. God damn, our damage do be low. Weird. The, the, the tier detonator, I think it detonates my um, my tears from my wisps rather than my uh, tech X. And that's what's happening there. This is going to be a mum fight where it was only foot and nothing else. That's weird. Oh, I just picked up whatever that is. I have absolutely no idea what that did. Um, we'll try to go light path here. Oh my god, this has been tragic. <laughs> this has been tragic. So we've, we've basically reached what power level we are sitting at now. And it's not good. Like, even with Tech X, this is still not a very good run. Like, our damage is still extremely low. Like, it's 0 0.5 above base. And that's... Do you know how we've... Do you know how we've received that damage? From two black hearts that give you... The, 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 the like, modded ones that give you a tiny bit of damage. That's the only damage we've received the entire run. We don't need, like, any curse trinkets. Now, that's the unfortunate thing about this character as well. Is once we get to this point, curse trinkets don't matter all so much. I think there is potential for shops on this floor. Although, I can't remember. Oh, there it is. Yeah, there's a shop here. Die already? Pfft, wow, I'm I'm absolutely blown away, blown away by the value of that shop. Holy, oh god! I don't know if I can handle my excitement. So much going on there for us. Wow, we come on now, game. Be reasonable. Be real. Don't be like this. Oh, wait. We have, uh... I tried to bomb my way out. We have doorstop. Okay. If we enter rooms we don't like, we can just fucking leave. Like that. Dead ends be gone. Oh, also, wait a minute. One sec. Let me, let me wait until this guy fires. Shielded Tears doesn't even work with Tech X. Come on now. What are you playing at, game? Why does Shielded Tears not work with Tech X? I mean, I know it'd be strong, but come on. It's a bit fucking rude. It's a bit fucking rude. We've got... Two to four random locusts. Actually pretty useful. Oh, we got this thing, the six pickups. We got spawn a loop card. Justice. Don't know what the fuck a loop card is. We got this thing. And we've got... Wait, is this is the same book I already had? What the fuck? I'm very confused. Oh, there you go. That's black charges. Gave me shop items, which unfortunately are all books. I'll keep this thing, though. This thing can be really good. We've had it before. Baby battery. Okay. 2020, the first semblance of damage increase we've had thus far. Wowie. This 
still though. It's only going to provide a little bit for us. I want Herming for the boss fight here because otherwise it's going to be tragic. Good. You're going to be a nuisance. Uh, get deaded. Oh my god. The fear is actually helping me out a ton here. Okay, just about got through that. I accidentally fucking walked out the door and wasted my magician card. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, game? Fuck's sake. I forgot the door would still be open and I like, backed into it. That's annoying. Not very good there. Lump of Coal would be a really good damage increase. I mean, I know for a fucking fact it's not going to give me it, because it would be. Why would it give me the thing that would be a nice damage increase? It's going to be Head of Krampus. <gasps> oh my lord. I feel so blessed. I feel so blessed. Right, next floor. Still got to look for our shop. Remember, it doesn't show up on the map. So we've got to actually look for it. Can't be that way. Yeah, Lump of Coal actually providing us with quite a lot of damage here. Oh, dude. These guys are so fast, they, like, don't stay on the lasers anywhere near long enough to, for me to do decent, decent damage. Spawns an active fireplace one tile away from the door. Nah, that sounds very frustrating. I'll take that. A burn heart, finally. He did it. He did the thing. Darn. Not really what I was looking for there. Minus speed, I'll take that as well, why not? I don't really care about my speed right now. Fill that burn heart up finally. Although it doesn't mean we lose our flight, I think. Yeah, it does. Wow, what, a, what an arcade, thanks. Hey, here's our shop. We found it. Dude, what the fuck? This game's fucking depressing. This has been like the worst possible run you can have as this character, I think. The shops, like, the entire idea of this character is all the shops, and the shops have just been absolute garbage. It's actually worth playing this guy for our active. We don't have money anymore either. It's actually pretty good. We'll take that. Come on, boy. Give us something good. Charge me all the way up.
Darn. Okay. Hey, we got some good stuff, although we now have no money to afford it. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Shit. <laughs> I need to try and find some money from somewhere. Okay. Slight invincibility here. Gave us some money. I need to do it for the invincibility again. Okay, we're all good, we're all good. Oh my god, we get our first damage up so far. Finally. We get ourselves 0.5 damage! As well as some damage for doing other various tasks here and there. Holy shit, can you believe it? Can you believe I'm about to leave this room and not do it? Because I can. Bye! Dude, I'm so frustrated that Shielded Tears doesn't work with Tech X. Like, come on now. I feel scammed. Oh, dude, I'm getting hit. A lot. Just put all this work in to get, to get enough money to get this item and I'm going to die straight away. Why do these little shits take so long to pop up compared to the regular guys? Really? No black hearts? God damn it. Okay. Extra burn heart. Appreciate it. I don't know what a gulp sound was then. Oh my god. Struggle busting our way through this run, my god. Oh wow! A golden blood earth! That's gonna be so valuable for us. Oh, come on, game. What is this? This is just mean is what it is. This is just mean. I don't have flight, so I can't even get that. God damn it. <gasps> shop? There's a shop on this floor? Ooh! Ooh! What a shop! <laughs> what the fuck are these shops? Like, are the ones that are on the womb and fair that just purposely really, really bad? Because they all look to be the same layout. If so, why? <laughs> Gives me no incentive at all to play the character to its strength of taking curses. There's absolutely no incentive to gain money. Like, there's all these cursed trinkets, there's just no point in picking any of them up, because there's just no... All the shops are terrible. Like, the earlier shops had the potential to be good, at least. They, they weren't. I got Tech X from one of them, I will say. Obviously, that's good. But overall, not very good for us. But the, the Womb ones and further, like, there's been one item. And unfortunately, it's always been trash. Dude, this little Grim Buddy's so good. A Burn Heart in here somewhere, apparently. There you go. So many extra Burn Hearts. Really, you? Did it have to be you? Oh, your fires go over rocks, do they? Okay, good to know. Good to know. We did get an angel item. We actually got a pretty good one. I don't know if the homing will affect this, though, with the butterfly. 
Probably not, but it at least makes our hitbox smaller. That's good at least. I kind of forgot we had Candied Heart. We are getting stabs when we grab Red Hearts, but not a ton. No. Yeah, no. <laughs> no thanks. I don't understand that room. Goodbye. How was all of this the wrong way? All of this was the wrong way. Are you kidding me? Why? <laughs> That didn't give me a stat up. Candied heart, you lying bastard. Has to be a real red heart, apparently. Don't even know how I'm meant to dodge those guys. Just get them off me. Stressing so much right now, honestly. <gasps> Damage! Oh no, that's range. God damn it. Thought I was onto a winner there. Right, lump of coal, do your business. Doesn't seem to be doing all that much, to be honest, lump of coal. I thought it was going to be really good, and it's... Mediocre at best. Get off me. Let me escape. Probably should have taken that after the boss fight, but it's fine. Whatever. I've got a lot of wisps around me. That should help. Even this fight is excruciatingly long. That was not what I wanted to do. Maybe I need to go like that. No, oh, really? Bombs? Do you want to like go where I want you to go here? Oh, I'm gaining damage ups. Don't really know what from, but... Getting constant damage. We're up to a great 5.26 damage. You know, the damage that you often have by floor 2 or 3. I don't know why I'm getting random damage. It must be because of the anger thing that I've got, but... Spiders, if you want to get in there and do your business, that'd be great. Dude, really? you got, like, a midgy of health left. Come on. You lost the Eternal Heart, of course. Right, these four chests better be absolutely amazing. One of them's reflected, which means we get five chests, which is good. Okay. First one, terrible. Second one, not terrible, but not amazing. Terrible. Um, copies your familiars. Maybe good. Terrible. Okay. That was truly amazing. In fact, everything there was pretty much useless. Everything. Even number two, because I'm not going to be charging long enough to make it take advantage of it, so... Pretty fucking useless. Oh, really? You're going to spawn a Skolex on this room too? Why? Oh my god, this run. This fucking run. Ow. I thought I had flight, my bad. Ugh. 
Okay, that's pretty good. Oh my god, okay, okay, okay. Good. 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 I think good? Yeah, good. That, that, makes, that makes no sense. Why, why not make the Tech X ring controllable rather than making it a Brimstone ring? But whatever. Whatever floats your goat, I guess. Doesn't make much sense to me, but I'll accept it. I got hit there, apparently. Angel disc I will keep, thank you. Keep that for a, a rainy day. Wait, does um I think I think thingy finally works now. What's its name? Um Shielded Tears. Okay, no, it it doesn't work. Or at least not fully. Boss is here. Bernhardt, thank you. Angel Disc didn't really provide us anything very good. Okay, it does seem to be working somewhat with Shielded Tears, but not consistently. Picked up a heart there, I don't know what the fuck that was from. Maybe that's a, a burn heart being replaced by another modded heart. Either way, it's gone now. <sighs> well, I can't believe we're getting away with this on this run, because this feel this felt like a really trash run, but we got there in the end. Nice. We got there in the end. Definitely not doing Delirium on this run. I cannot. I just can't. Either way, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one.